Good evening, Chancellor, Vice-Chancellor, graduates and guests. My name is Hayley Cohen, and it's an honour and a great privilege to stand before you as valedictorian. And I thank the university for this opportunity. When I enrolled in the Juris Doctor, my mother and I were moving to Queensland. We were living out of a suitcase and we had no idea where we were going to live. I called a few universities and not one offered external study at the time. So I want to thank UniSQ for providing students with distance education. I appreciate universities who strive to make learning accessible for everyone. And not only students who live in major cities have permanent residence and can afford to study on campus. And thank you to all the guests here today who supported our graduates throughout their studies. It was during this degree that I truly understood the importance of a solid support system. For all those who lived with the graduates while they studied, I salute you. Thank you for your perseverance. If your home was anything like mine, I had a strict no noise policy. My poor mum has been living, walking on eggshells for the past three years, especially during exam time. My demands for absolute silence became more fastidious as the exams got closer and closer. I would yell, Mum, stop vacuuming. That is really not a priority in our lives right now. And then it became, Mum, can you turn the TV down? I'm already overwhelmed as it is. And then eventually, Mum, can you please stop breathing? It's distracting. To all the graduates that studied while raising children, I take my hat off to you. I'm sure it was a lot more difficult to implement a no-noise policy, and I cannot imagine the challenges that you faced. There was one lady in my mediation class, a single mother of three pursuing a law degree, and I think that that is incredible. So, on the topic of single mums, thank you to my mum, Susie. I couldn't have done this without you. Graduating today is as much your success as it is mine, and I love you so much. Thanks for putting up with me. And my brother, Dean. We've been through so much together. We lost our father, we lost our brother, way before their time was meant to be up. But we always managed to find something to laugh about, even during those darkest days. And we always managed to pick ourselves up after a big knock to the ground. To the graduates who have lost dear loved ones, milestones like today can be particularly hard. And if you're like me, you would do anything to be able to share the good news with them. As valedictorian, my role is to speak on behalf of the graduates and discuss a little bit about what student life was like. Our stories will be different, of course, but I would like to share some personal anecdotes about the good, the bad, and the ugly of pursuing a university degree. Much I hope will resonate with most of you here today. Starting at the ugly. While our friends were on holidays, looking fresh, relaxed, basking in the sunshine, taking a gazillion pics for their social media, we were at our desk, another sleepless night, under the lamplight, hunched over our computer like some pale vampiric creature. The bad, no money, and a diet of two-minute noodles. Before my evidence exam, I was so nervous that I ended up in the fetal position, rocking back and forth, thinking, how on earth am I going to get through the next three hours? But we always manage to pull through. You just have to take a deep breath, put one foot in front of the other, and in the words of Martin Luther King, if you can't walk, then crawl. And the good is that it was worth every bit of the struggle. Gaining a degree is something that we will have for the rest of our lives. It is something that can never be taken away from us. It is something that has lasting benefits. It has opened my life to new ideas 
and opportunities that I never thought was possible. Before my law degree, I couldn't tell you what the constitution was. Embarrassingly, I thought a deposit was called a downposit. People always wanted to box me as a ditzy girl. Many doubted that I would even finish this degree. But I never allow anyone to define who I am. We are all capable of achieving great things if we're willing to sacrifice and put in the hard work. And I think this is an opportune moment to thank the academic staff for their generosity in sharing their knowledge with us students. I have learned an incredible amount from you. I also want to thank my friend James, who believed I had no limits and who pushed me to reach for the stars. I am forever grateful. My fellow graduates who are nervous about entering into their new careers, you are not alone. I am absolutely terrified about going into the legal profession. It's a horrible feeling to go outside your comfort zone, but the rewards are far greater, as we have learned from our university experience. We had our nervous breakdowns, we lived off two-minute noodles, we morphed into vampires, and we crawled over the finish line. And here we are today, standing proud as graduates. To my fellow graduates, I wish you fulfilling careers and every success in life. Thank you, UniSQ, for putting on today, and thank you all for being part of our graduation. Good night.